Jackman Series Models 12-Speed Transmission Gear Shift Operation Instructions 12-Speed Transmission Gear Description For vehicles equipped with manual transmission, MT, gear shifts will inevitably occur during driving. Take fast 12-speed transmission as an example. When the pre-selection valve handle is down, the transmission is in the low gear area and it can be switched between one to six gears at this time. When the pre-selection valve handle is up, the transmission is in the high gear area and it can be switched between seven to 12 gears at this time. Special attention should be paid to fast main and auxiliary box structure vehicles during high and low gear area conversion. The high and low gear zone conversion is automatically completed by the gas circuit control. Explanation of the transition from low gear area to high gear area. Conversion from low gear area to high gear area. Note, during high and low gear shifting, you must not skip gears. First, move the pre-selection valve to high gear. Depress the clutch. Stagnation for one second after being engaged in neutral. Note, gearing without stopping in the neutral zone will damage the synchronizer and other parts. The high and low gear synchronizer is hung into the high gear area driven by the cylinder. After the high and low gear synchronizer conversion is completed, hang into the seventh gear. Explanation of the transition from high gear area to low gear area. Transition from high gear area to low gear area. Note, during high and low gear shifting, you must not skip gears. First, move the pre-selection valve to high gear. Depress the clutch. Stagnation for one second after being engaged in neutral. Note, engagement without stopping in the neutral zone will damage the synchronizer and other parts. The high and low gear synchronizer is hung into the low gear area driven by the cylinder. After the high and low gear synchronizer conversion is completed, hang into six gears. The 12 speed transmission shift is explained. Fault display. Failure to follow the above steps will directly cause the auxiliary box synchronizer to be damaged to varying degrees. Failures such as friction material damage, synchronizer lock pin breaking, and synchronization drum toothing will occur.